Hey, how you doing guys? Today in this video, I'm gonna show you what happened with this Tahoe 2001. The same is gonna be for, I think for any vehicle, but uh, if you have a, a Tahoe, Yukon, Suburban, um, Avalanche or whatever, and you you have this problem, I'm gonna I'm gonna share with you how to fix it. Um, I already did it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try to explain to you what I did and what was you know uh, happened with this car. So the problem was that um, this gentleman tried to uh, turn it on, and the thing is that this thing doesn't uh, turn, so it was stuck over here. So he was not able to turn it. The, turn the truck on so it was the problem so and we had to replace the ignition switch cylinder so that that was the that was the problem we had to replace it and here's the part number that I use but uh, you can you can buy it anywhere so any auto uh, auto part um, Ignition switch cylinder. That's why you have to replace. Okay. Uh, all right. If this thing turns, you're gonna go. You're gonna go to the on position. Okay. You're gonna turn on your car. Okay. And then this little guy has the this clip over here. This little thing. But first, you have to disconnect your battery. Okay, disconnect the battery, battery, and then you're gonna, you're gonna, you need this this guy to go on the on position, and then it's gonna be aligned on line with this hole right here, okay, and then you're gonna stick, you're gonna stick something, it's gonna be like this, all right, and then let me show you, I need to, I need, I'm gonna take this off, the key. All right, I'm gonna put it like that, and then if you have, if as soon as you align align the this thing with the hole with this hole, it needs to be in the on position. That's why you have to disconnect the battery. So it got gonna it's gonna be like this. So you're gonna stick the uh, you're gonna stick something some kind of tool over here on this little hole, and then it's gonna be aligned with the um, with this uh with this thing right here so you're gonna push it you're gonna push it out uh push it in and the same thing you're gonna you're gonna pull it pull it you're gonna pull it out because you're gonna be like over here with your hand try to um, trying to to pull it out so when you are pressing over here okay you're pressing this little thing and then pull it out okay the problem was over here that um this thing was stuck on the off position so to move this thing to make it turn so there's a clip over here um it's like if you see this line this line is the same uh let me see what i put the other one all right the 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 line you see over here over here, this line on the black tank, it's a line, it's a line with the with this little thing, all right. So when you turn this, when you turn the your your car on, it's gonna be on the on position. I'm gonna show you right now. Okay, and I'm gonna turn the heat on because the air on. So now we have the. Now we got the the line. This little thing aligned with the um, with the hole where you're gonna stick the tool. So if it it doesn't, uh, you need to like go all the way. Try to try to go all the way, and then align with this thing, and then press that thing, and then pull it. Okay. But the thing is, this thing was over here on the bottom. On the bottom so I'm gonna show you this one is broke because uh, I broke it that's the only way so let's think that it's like like this so eh, like some like this I can see when they're on the, on the, 
Mm, all right, so it was. You need to go all the way like this. But if it's an off position, it's gonna be like this. So this thing, when you put the key in, this thing goes down and let the let you turn the key. But the problem was that uh, you put the. I was trying to put the the key on, and this thing doesn't move. So that was the problem. So you have to stick something over here and try to press this down and then at the same time you have to like keep like playing with the key and you know pressing it pressing over here and then um, eventually it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna come it's gonna let your let your turn okay the the key otherwise you're not gonna make it all right so I break it it's like this you know let me align with the you see the line it was the line with the with the little thing over here I don't know it's a uh, kind of kind of weird and uh, like on video but it's like this so you have to break this thing with the screwdriver but first thing you gotta do is rip this this little thing is like um I don't know it's nothing hard so break it with something with a flat screwdriver that's what I did so I was using this um this kind of tools, picks and screwdrivers and I break it down. All right, so you're gonna, you're gonna break the thing first and then this one. And then if you can, uh, I mean, if you have to break this one too, that way they give you more room to stick something. Let me see what uh, I was using. I think I was using this one over here uh, so the thing it's over here I was pushing that thing in this thing so this thing I was trying to oops I was trying to push it in and then at the same time turning turning the key so and eventually this thing uh, let me turn the key and as soon as you you feel the the, um, the key turns just let it go let it go and like turn it just it's gonna turn just keep it keep, keep it going keep going into the end position okay all the way to the end position and make sure the line this this line over here uh, what is it what is it um, so this line aligns with the with this hole, okay? Gotta be like this, okay? Not 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 the way it was. So you gotta be all the way, and then you're gonna be able to press this thing, okay? And then pull it, and that's gonna come out. Stick the stick any two like these little guys, and then yeah, well. You know what? If if you have something like this, it's a lot better. My may this thing might be don't reach all the way, so it gotta be something like this. Okay. So all right, guys. I hope you like this video. I mean, I already did it all. And the thing is that you have to take off those plastic, those plastics over here. The one one in the top, one in the bottom. There's a, a T twenties. T20s, there are three of them, two or three of them, something like that. All right, check that off, and then you don't have to like just yeah, check it out. Just uh, as soon as you take those bolts off, you're gonna you're gonna just put your hands like separate from here, separate them, and then that's it, guys. Not not a big deal. If you need to remove um, the thing on the bottle, what I did, I mean. I don't know why, but I think it's a little easier. Remove this thing, two bolts, one in the bot, one over here, one in the other side. So, but not a big deal. All right, guys. I hope you like this video. If it was, uh, just like, subscribe. You know, I'm gonna be uploading more videos. Visit my channel. I got a couple, couple videos. They might, they might help you. All right. All right. See you at the next video, guys.